All right, folks, the deck is Dragon Control Warrior. The goal of the deck is to stack a bunch of armor in the early game, make good use of Onyxian Drake and Shield Slam to remove our opponent's stuff, and eventually work our way towards some high value dragons, including Deathwing Mad Aspect, Raid Boss Onyxia, and Kazakasam to really find a legitimate win condition. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash Raffle. Watch this! Yikes, Questline Hunter's a bit of a struggle. We're gonna need to stack a lot of armor and maybe get a Bulwark, so let's hard mull for Forge of Souls. <laughs> or just draw two weapons instead. We have our oh. Into our Wait, that's much better for me, isn't it? Although it does make my mulligan a bit of an oof. Dead eye? Is that worth a minefield here? I think it is. Because they're likely to have another 2-3 and I don't want them to be able to hear them. Like if they hit the uh, garrison commander it's so much damage on uh, turn 2. Oh, now I don't even need to play the buckler. Ooh. Um. Honestly, that's not a bad hit for me. Like, the, if we're going to take a turn off, it might as well be to essentially match their turn off. So, I think I'm okay with that. Aim for the wheels. Actually make use of these weapons. No Punk. Okay. Maybe now I have too many weapons, but that heavy plate isn't looking too bad. Hey, welcome, Pedro. Aramstein. Punk. Alright. I want the card draw or the armor? I think I actually want the, uh... Armor. Who needs a bunker when you have this? Alright. Add more card draw. Thank you for the 21 months. I can't think of a clever joke, but thanks for all the content. You're very welcome. Thank you for that support. And Bloodseeker is uh, unlikely to get any value against me, so... I think just like a Dragon Bane is my primary concern from here. Opponent deciding if to concede or not? Yeah. Seems that way, doesn't it? I think they rolled a pretty unfortunate matchup. Oh. Wait, that actually changes things. That gives them some late game. gets to kill a huffer, but I lose, like, the consistent armor gain. Let's see if we can... Well, this doesn't actually do anything anymore, does it? Because I drew the buckler. Right. No hmm? Okay, that gives me a card. Sure. You made any good decks? I have no legendaries. Uh, yeah, quite frequently. Big boy. Could just bash it into the opponent's face. Do I want to take that much damage, though? Unstoppable. I could put the damage on Deathwing instead, but that makes it kind of easy to remove, especially for an improved explosive trap. But what if I just take the damage to face? And Deathwing him and start pressuring him? 
Cataclysm. Gives me... There's no freezing trap. Can't believe standard is as crazy as it is right now. I mean... This is like the craziest standard ever gets, right? Is the final expansion of the... Of the rotation. I'll do it again. Jeez. Alright. Threatening lethal seems pretty good. We didn't even need to draw into any of our win con Well, I guess uh, Deathwing's a pretty good win condition in this matchup, yeah. That can't feel good. That also can't feel good. What's that last card? Is it another quick shot? Alright. We're just smorking now. I mean, I was thinking the same thing, Tavish. Another hunter? But do I just like have to keep the Kazakus man to uh actually have a win condition against Questline? This scout, thank you for the 17 months. Maybe I shouldn't no, uh, this is like only gonna get played if it's another even hunter. But if it's Questline. I probably don't give them minions so that I can nullify some of their cards. But I drew a whole lot of minions. <laughs> uh oh. What do you think about people saying Gazakazan is a problem? I think that they're probably playing a different format than I am. Hey, Raffle Cool Hearthstone Deck Tracker application. What could be the name of this marvelous computer application and where could I find it? A website to download it. Well, you can type exclamation point Firestone to download Firestone, who is in fact a sponsor of today's stream, so. Great question. Still got one more turn before that's a thing. No, oh, we do have lots of armor to gain. Um, kind of need to find like a shield shatter for the Avish, though. Pretty good pacing by the opponent here. Next turn is going to be this into this to kill the Tavish, and then I just have to slow the uh... Oh, okay, maybe they don't even have a quest completion this turn. Oof, I drew into it. As long as that last card isn't Furious Howl, which now that I am saying these words, I'm realizing that's a big mistake. Nice. 
Nice. Ian, thank you for the $2 tipping Roth coin. Roughly, I hear that Firestorm is sponsor sponsoring your streams. They're not sponsoring me, but I'll give them props for being pretty great. I've been using them for Battlegrounds for quite a bit, and it helps my achievement tracking for heroes I don't have first place with yet. Download Firestone chat to support Raffle and get some sweet features with your deck tracker. I mean, Twitch chat just selling out for me. Oh my god, they had it. Desert, thank you for the yeah, sub. Really appreciate that. I mean... Yeesh. Hey, there's the shield shatter. All right. My creation, the treasure hoard. Things to go face. That was a bit of an oof towards the end. All right. Shouldn't die from 18, right? Uh, that's not true, because they could have another Howl. Thanks. Please no. Okay. You can gain 10 armor here, at least. Or just kill them with the Locusts. Maximize my armor gain this turn. Because I have the lethal set up with the two swings of the weapon. Seymour, thank you for the nine months. No. Oh. Another quick shot? Okay. Whew. Oof. 200% win rate, by the way. I'm gonna keep the heavy plate just to trade it away and actually use my mana on turn one. Oop. Job done. And mage? Yeah, that could be. I don't know, mage is... kind of in a weird place right now. It's like Secret Mage. Got a lot of removal that I can make use of, so. I think there was a version of Ping Mage that did run a single Arcanologist just to pull the ice blocks, but that looks like a secret. Is too full. Who could have foreseen that one coming? Aside from the opponent, I guess. I'm late. I'm late. Oh. Oh. That's the second copy of Explosive Runes, so it's the last one I need to worry about. Excuse me. You are on fire. Let's test for counter here. Is that it? Is it another rig fair game? No. Uh, it can't be explosive. Flame ward, maybe? Kinda do need doing cards, right? Oasis ally. Never remember the Oasis ally. No, not that either. Gotta be Flame Ward or Ice Block, I guess. Play Pirate Warrior, but with a twist. I am. The twist is that there's no pirates or quest, and instead they're dragons. Yeah. 
think that's a much better twist. Take no prisoners. Kind of trying to block the second uh, rigged fair game, but it's just going to go off here, isn't it? Chat likes dragons? What? You mean dragon D's notes? Got him. I'm late. I'm late. Hey, uh, are we done with counter spells yet? No, there's one more, right? Next turn, we get the Onyxia down. So that's no more counter spells, no more explosive runes. Maybe it's Flame Ward and Ice Block, maybe? What once was cloudy. Look at us, Chad, getting to turn 10. Incredible. Nixie about to be turned into a sheep? That's not a real card. We have many secrets. I'm the brood mother. Don't you ever forget? You ain't seen nothing. Pretty good. That is true, you are almost out of cards, and you only have two fireballs and uh, one valet left, so I don't think you're getting there, friend. I intend to deceive. God bless them, they're trying, though. So? Wait, your fireball? Oof. I can't feel good at this stage in the game. Yes, I do! I just need an early Kazakasan in this matchup, right? Because I can't possibly, like, do enough to remove their stuff. Oh, hey. Alright, now I gotta dodge the, uh, the rats. I wouldn't mind this getting ratted. Exclamation point rat? Oh. Okay. Well, I found my rat protection now, didn't I? Your deck is almost standard, lol. I do not care. You know what they call an almost standard deck, though? A wild deck. Avoid playing minions if I don't have to. And I want to look for burst off of the Xacus man. Didn't see a lot of uh, Buzz Boys back into these lists, and it does not make sense to me.
Whoops. I'm not sure what I thought happened there. Uh, maybe I was thinking I played the heavy plate instead. I don't know. That seemed real dumb, though. Oh, it's a here. Yep, nice totem you got there. To be honest, it doesn't really matter what I burned in that state because I'm just always playing a tempo Kazaka San. Like, that's the only way I could possibly win this, so. Wow. Wow! Yeah, just want locusts and books. I've got enough removal, so I guess it's the Rager. Book. This goes face. I need more face! This goes face. I've got relatively cheap treasures, right? Job done. They have Devolve? That's fine. They have to draw it still, and... what? Like, I didn't really have great options. Aside from that. Am I brawling this or no? There are better brawls. Let's develop the minion here. I don't really need to worry about rat so much anymore. But I held on to the brawl. Oh, he just won't die. That's a big oof. Wow, that just destroyed me. I can't beat Reno, so I hope they don't have it. You playing this deck ironically? Uh, no, I'm playing this deck because I want to play the deck. What is your obsession with how standard the deck is? is Wait, they had two? They got both of those? Ha! What? That is unbelievable. That's lethal, right? Ignis, thank you for the eight months. 
Uh, Shaman is once again just like rushed to the uh, Gazakus man. This battlefield will be mine. Imagine how easy the uh, the pirate warrior matchup would be if they didn't have the quest line to give them infinite value in the late game. Like I legitimately just farm them mercilessly, and that's why the quest line is dumb. Uh-oh. I uh, just need to stack as much armor as I can. Uh, the Blade Storm, though, is good at removing their frog, so... At least they don't get two turns of it. There's no way they coin a Drek'thar here, though, right? You check Secret Mage during the Barons and see Pirate Warrior from the last VS report, the Pirate Warrior is very polarizing. I mean, it's only polarizing when it has almost entirely favorable matchups. That's... I think they're going to need to turn off here. Well, I guess it's certain that they're going to have a turn off here given how much they overloaded, so. Just one more frog I need to worry about. They don't have it this turn at least. Am I dead though? Can't be that big of a... Okay, it can be a big overload. Or overdraft rather. But that's both lightning blooms, right? Gotta swing first. There you go. didn't even use the overdraft. Th oh, overdraft next turn, so gotta stack the armor. Hey, this is the the, the core bliss, right? So, uh... Oops! I'm just gonna slam this now, because I do not want to mess around with any... Yeah. Ooh! If I can get this on curve, that might give me a chance. Job done. Wait, what? I'd rather have one hour battle against priests and secret mage. Those are very different things, first of all. And like the the thing that you want can't exist anymore because of the decks that push secret mage out of the, the metagame. While it could exist theoretically against a deck like secret mage. So it's not that I like miss playing against secret mage because I loved uh, having to like guess around the secrets. It's just like secret mage wasn't a deck that beat everything. And so it was you actually saw other decks in the format, whereas like Pirate Warrior's grip on the metagame is uh, pretty limiting in terms of what decks can be played. Oh my god. Could this actually be a mirror match? It's beautiful, chat. And we get an early Kazakus man? Is that going to be good though? Like, yeah, probably. I just need to go for, like, still go for the aggressive uh, stuff. The rest of my 
hand is kind of bad in this matchup, though, because it's all pretty reactive. Jeez. All right. I mean, hand so bad, I kind of am forced to uh, go for the Gazaka's man next turn. Okay. Well, what if I just play this? These are annoying. I don't know if I can get there with just damage, right? I can try. I've got a lot of spells. Okay, Locust is good. Locust and Bo- oh my god. <laughs> okay. We're in business now. That's why I didn't feel good about the Deathwing, just going in naked like that when it dies to Shield Slam, the, the opponent's current health total. Gotta yeah, try and sneak it out sometime, right? But yeah, we did get an obscene amount of damage, uh, which we're going to need because the opponent is at 47 already. Not a very clean clear, at least. Are they going for some sort of combo? Is this Noggin Fogger Warrior? <laughs> no, they're clearly uh, for, um, Dragon Warrior, right? Okay. I mean, I guess I just have to use my mana doing this. Remove their armor. never seen that card in my life played against me, I don't think. Nice. Oh. oh that last one was lagging. Turns out it was a good choice to get the Kazakus man down early. Cute locusts? I mean, they're pretty for locusts, but I, I don't know that I call them cute. Oh, God! <laughs> Just immediately answered with a single card. Oh, my God. That was brutal. I think I want the Anoya horn here. Well, didn't get it. Keep pointing those up at their face. And the Ranker. No? no? Okay. I feel like I'm too weak to brawl if I do that. Have you ever picked the treasure jar? Uh, yeah. I mean, it's not like a high priority pick. In fact, it's pretty bad at times, but it's a fun choice if you can get things that build a board like, well, like we did here. Okay. It's a good opening for me. Because I don't think... Like, it's going to be very hard for the opponent to get things that are anywhere near the quality of treasures that we got. And we've got a life total lead. So. I think we'll be fine here. I'll probably even just go face with these and shield slam that. Have another slow turn.
be getting some good value off of that, unfortunately. Bait. Match is going to last forever. Have you what? <laughs> Have you seen the uh things that I got? Like it's gonna be over very soon once I draw the books. It's only going slow because the opponent's taking so long. Yeah. Probably need to rip an Annoia horn here unless I hit an... Well, even with the other clockwork, it's not great, but the horn's pretty good. There's no reason to play the book here. I've got 14 damage from the book, plus once my board is clear, I have four... Like, I can just clear my own board, too. Once I hit the second book. Yeah, I actually did get a pretty good set of secrets. Or secrets, though. So. Uh, let's see. I have 14 bursts from hand. For some reason, I always think they're one ones because that's something that's actually balanced. <laughs> Thank you to legendary patrons Brian Wynn, Bizzle Jizzix, Gian Rusi, Gigantic Donuts, HS Battlefly, Jeffrey Pierce, Justice Crater, Korback, Noggleshire, Nate Drex, St. Arthur, Shadow1TV, Sognisman, and Vanfix. 